News Channel 21 Sports Report is brought to you by Papa Murphy's. Change the way you pizza. The Bend Endurance Academy is hosting more than 10 kids ahead of the Youth Climbing Nationals. Dylan Anderman was there to see their pre pre preparation. The Bend Endurance Academy has been training 10 to 16 year old climbers for the Youth Nationals. It's so epic because we're just like learning how to do new movements and like how to move your body better to get different moves sort of. And it's an opportunity for them to really go out and put on a show for themselves and perform for themselves. Executive Director Mike Ruggi has been training young climbers for almost 20 years. What brings the athletes here is it's a four day intensive camp where we're going over like mental preparation, physical preparation, going over tactics um, as they apply to competition climbing. The competitors come from all around Oregon, Washington and California. At nationals they'll compete in bouldering, sport climbing and speed climbing. I just really wanted to experiment with some cool boulders and this gym offers a lot of cool bouldering opportunities so that's why I'm here. The academy moves the rocks on the wall based on a climber's skill. Trying it gave me an appreciation of the skill it takes. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Anyone can do it. That one's for our kindergarten. That one's for our kindergarten. <laughs> I could only do the lowest level, the kindergarten level, but the kids were able to increase the difficulty. I've learned a lot about like breathing and the mental game and climbing from Ross Fulkerson and the coaches. Ross Fulkerson, a member of the Climbing US national team, came from San Diego to share some tips. It's fun to be able to kind of give back and teach these kids what I wish I was learning at their age and these exact same types of clinics were where I learned the most about climbing and met some of my best friends to this day. I'm definitely not as good as these kids, but it is very fun. Nationals is July 6th through the 14th in Salt Lake City. From Ben Endurance Academy, Dylan Anderman, News Channel 21.